Hey guys, thought I'd give you a quick update on where we're at. I've got the VFD mounted, and we've got uh, some temporary wiring to the motor. All the old wiring is gone. I've got this piece kind of bent back into shape, and it's ready just about to be welded. What else? Oh, I discovered why there's only three belts. Some moron bent this pulley. I don't know if you can see it on the motor side. It's all bent up and I'm sure it was throwing belts. So let's plug her in quick and I can show you where I'm at with running it. See what it does. Heard the drive kick on. And I've got temporarily wired into this switch a foot pedal. So I'm going to have a push to start button here. And then to shut it off, you'll just click the, the pedal to shut it off. So let's fire it up and see how it does. Fairly quiet, fairly smooth. Uh, the other thing, well, let's shut her off first. Pretty quick stop. I have the deceleration on the drive set pretty fast. Let's try it one more time. It's about as quick as this one can stop. Uh, the other thing, let me fire it back up. You'll see the belts jump because they don't bend real easy. Kind of see them down there. They're hopping all over the place. So we're going to change those out to these adjustable AccuLink belts. They're supposed to be really vibration free, but we will see what they do. And the other project I got going on is this wiring box. I'm going to try and get rid of it and build my own out of just a piece of straight tubing and then build my own cover for it. So I might bring you along with that, I might not. I still have, now that I know everything works, we can finalize wire and get everything hooked up correctly.